Hey everyone, Big Paulie back for a brand new video. It's really warm today. Where's the best place to go when it's really hot? That's right, into the cinema to watch a classic, a 40 year old classic. Let's go and watch The Empire Strikes Back. So just got out of the cinema. What an experience, fantastic. Uh, really well set up by the cinema staff. Very few staff, probably about three members of the staff. Uh, there was a lady uh, welcoming you as you come in the cinema through the foyer, uh, who then asked you, do you already have a ticket pre-booked? So I said, yes. She said, okay, go over to the food counter uh, and have my mobile scanned my little QR code and they would print out a ticket so as they printed out me a ticket I got a bottle of water uh, as the cappuccino machine was not working um, and then I wandered over to the entrance to the screens there's one way in one way out so they've got it sort of like cordoned off you have to follow a one-way system uh, so she asked me to put the ticket down on the table so she could have a look at it and then she said yep yeah, go through uh, and first screen on the right, on the left, screen one. So that was all pretty good, fantastic. Uh, as I actually went in, when I was at the foyer, the, the lady did say that I don't have to wear a mask in the foyer and in the cinema. They're not hold, upholding to what they're stating. So she says, you don't need to wear a mask in the cinema. Uh, you don't even need to wear it in the foyer. But I did, I wore it to the seat and then I wore it from the seat back. Um, as they had like bleeding nuclear masks on, uh, they had like one of those full NHS glass shield ones. So I thought it's only right that I should do it as well. Um, only one other person in the screen other than me. <laughs> but that's to be expected uh, with films like Empire Strikes Back, you know. A lot of people are not going to rush out to go and see films like that because you know they've got them in their home collection and i've seen comments saying why go to the cinema to see a film that you already own on blu-ray it's for the big screen experience the same as back to the future good god uh, goodfellas the dark knight it's a chance to, for us to see the films again on the big screen a funny thing happened in empire strikes back though i've seen empire strikes back tons of times at home but for, for some unknown reason, seeing this on the big screen in the cinema kicked off a kind of a memory, kicked off a memory from back in the 80s. Uh, and I was remem remembering going to see it in uh, my hometown. So it's 40 years ago, 40 years ago now, I actually saw this film probably about 300 yards away from where this where the cinema was it was in the old abc on castle street um but uh very strange if you go back 40 years and say in 40 years time you're going to be watching this exact same film in the cinema just around the corner i would not have, i would not have believed you but the other memory that sparked was i suddenly remembered playing with my star wars action figures and my atats and and the snow speeders out in the back garden and uh, blowing the attacks up and knocking them over. I've never thought about that before when I've watched Empire at home, but I don't, maybe it's a combination because of Dover and maybe my mum and things that have happened this last year, lockdown and, um, and seeing this again on the big screen sparked off some very fond memories from my childhood, which was really nice. 
but uh, yeah, had a great experience. Loved every minute of it. Picture was fantastic. The sound was fantastic. Lots of deep bass, uh, especially on the Etats. But uh, yeah, had a great time. Uh, if you're worried about going to the cinema during these times, you really don't need to. It's safe. Special Cineworld specifically at the moment because views not open a few Odeons are open I believe but Cineworld are doing everything they can to make your welcome back uh, as pleasant as possible and as carefree as possible and uh, when you book your you book your seat and then each two seats opposite you so two seats on the left two seats on the on the right of you you cannot book other people cannot book so you'll be like a meter apart from each from each per, uh, each person not that that's a problem at the moment because you know there's not a lot of people going to the cinema but um it's you know for peace of mind so you don't think that somebody's going to come coughing all over you and sitting right next to you so uh, if you go onto the website once you book your ticket you'll know that people can't book next to you but yeah i had a great experience i'm gonna go again maybe with back to the future or the dark knight uh, I did have a phone call from my boss the other day saying that they're bringing everybody back to work next week so I'm back to work on Monday. Uh, it's been nearly six months I've had off so I don't know if I can remember what to do when I get back to work but it'll certainly be an experience so uh, I might not to get to go as often as I can but uh, yeah I mean I only saw maybe one other person in the whole of the cinema and that was the person that was in my screen so I'm sure it'll get busier a little bit busier during the evenings so I hope you enjoyed my little uh, return to the cinema um, it's been a long time coming but feeling more comfortable and uh, it's just great to get back I know we haven't got these big films even though they did advertise a few big films on the trailers uh, but it's nice to get back into the cinema to get things going and uh, hopefully it won't be long before we get to see things like Tenant and, and Wonder Woman and Bond. Brilliant. So hope you enjoyed the video. Like it by giving it some thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Uh, comment down below. Have you gone back to the cinema? Or you've gone back to see any particular films? Uh, I'm hoping to see Russell Crowe's Unhinged. Hopefully in the next week. Uh, it's the first new release. Uh, but uh, tell me what you've seen down below. And uh, I'll see you on the next video. Bye.